Thank you for tuning in to the 2024 World Coconut Championship. We are in the final 16, and in this matchup, we have on your left, Travis Keener from the Extra Pint Coconut Club Toledo versus on your right, all the way from Japan, Ryo Fukuda. Both of these players have traveled great lengths to be at this tournament and are now in the final 16 competing for a spot in the semifinal bracket. Keener to open up with a 20. Rio will have hammer advantage but goes long on his opening shot. Keener now to hit and stick, happily placed in front of the post. Rio able to get the off but now play on the outside on Keener's side of the board. Happy to keep play out there, and Rio will be forced to peel. Looks like he was trying to angle and catch Keener's disc as well. Unsuccessful, and leaves an open 20 for Keener, which he converts on. Keener, again, most likely content to keep play on the outside and hides very nicely behind that post. For those of you who have been paying attention to the World Crokinole series, you will recognize Travis Keener from the doubles division, who placed fourth in the World Crokinole Doubles Championship alongside his partner, Chris Flossback. And Keener with a very nice bounce back off the post, pointing towards the camera, hoping for that highlight shot. He knows that somebody perhaps has been putting in work to make him famous, and that will surely be clipped later. Down to the last shot, Keener with 320s, not much Rio can do, and Keener will be taking this first round, bringing the score to 2-0. to zero. Again, these games are four rounds, players playing seven games each, so we are into the second round now. Rio to open up, and coming up short, a backboard opportunity for Keener, which he converts on with the hammer advantage, up a 20. Keener is surely feeling comfortable as he looks to take that second 20 and he does. Rio now finding his range as we head into this 20s race. Keener has had great success in the 20s game. You may have seen him on YouTube with what was a 20s consecutive record. I believe he hit 30. I will surely be corrected. The current record is 38, but 30 20s in a row is still mighty impressive. And we see that on full display in this match. As he is now up 120 with only a few bullets left for each player. Comes up short. A very heavy hanger, but certainly a chance here for Rio. And just lips a little bit far. Keener happy to get play away from the middle. I'm not sure that's what he intended, but... Works out nonetheless, and Keener will take this second round, bringing the score to 4-0. to zero. See some highlight shots, these backboard 20s from both players. We go into the third round now, and Keener will be opening up and comes up short. A backboard opportunity here for Rio, which an unfortunate catch at the pegs, that bouncing button, Catches Rios, making sure that the 20 doesn't happen. Keener, unfortunately, catches his own, but behind the pegs now. Rio, content to hit and stick. He does have hammer, so there is no need to peel there. Keener trying to angle in for that 20, but instead sets up Rio for an opportunity here, which Rio converts on, being the first to get a 20 in this game. Again, a little bit strong lipping out. And if Rio can convert, he will have a mighty advantage. Doesn't quite get it, but in an awkward spot, you see Travis looking around for the best possible angle. Going for that push, just a little bit short again. And Rio able to convert now up. 220s in the cup with the hammer. Only a few bullets left. Keener needs a mistake out of Rio if he wants to get back in this game. And there is maybe an opportunity. This is a very tough shot, but the follow through 20 would do it. Follows through, but not quite in the right spot. 
Rio, yep, very content to hit and stick there. No chance for Keener now. Still goes for the shot, gets it through. Very nice, but alas, this third round will go to Rio, bringing the score to 4-2 for to Keener. Rio still has the opportunity to tie this match again. Every point matters. The two players with the highest scores from each pool will move on to the semi-final round. Rio to open up in round four of this match. Getting that open 20, it seems as though he has found his range now. Keener following suit. And we will see which player will come up short first. And it is Rio with a backboard opportunity now for Keener. She doesn't get right back to Rio. Rio, I'm not sure if he was looking to convert, but has left his disc in somewhat of an awkward spot. Might be a touch 20 here for Keener. Keener does have hammer, but it looks like he was fighting for that. Didn't quite get it. Being tied in the 20s cup. Play is on the outside. Keener is definitely not upset about this situation, although a double here would be nice. And he gets it, keeping his on. Play on the outside. Rio knows it. Forces him to peel. Back to this 20s race now. It's an unfortunate situation to have to peel with Keener because his 20s game is just so strong. And we see that on display here as he is currently up in the 20s cup. Short again from Rio, leaving a backboard. Keener has sealed this final round, bringing the score of this match to 6-2. to two. Fantastic work from both of these players who travel from far and wide to be at this tournament. Thank you for tuning in and stay tuned for the semi-final round. Make it a great day.